Why so much pirat and so little cloner when called? Uh, because he's gonna be like the better tempo guy, in my opinion. I'm also pretty good at piloting Billy for whatever reason. And I just have like pretty good outcomes on him. Mm hmm. <laughs> I guess, um, glue is BRB as well. That's gonna be like fully fine. Okay, no, he's here. Um, sure. Okay, uh, we have Men of the Sea there, and we have all the free scrolls immediately. We have Cards of Prophecy, as was meant to be. Uh, there's not a lot of knowledge here, actually. Hmm. Anyway, I would be able to like go here to be back. Okay, he resets anyway. I guess it doesn't matter. Oof, I love when he stopped with a lot of gold. He actually does feel pretty good. Especially on a good faction like Gov already. Mm hmm. Hmm. Um, let's see, like, what's outside. Um, I'm more uh, leaning towards resetting this right now. Neutral side, interesting. My bomb, I don't see anything interesting at all. Um, Stronghold mid is kind of good for me. Um, Undead, so that was the opponent's bomb, and Castle side. So I could just play the Castle side, but maybe I'll scale him even. Hmm. Not very likely to happen. Uh, the layout of the bunker is like so. I'm... I like the amount of knowledge, but um, I think I can do better. I can do better! Uh, yep. I can fly up to the magic wall here, here. Yeah, I'm gonna be like leaving almost immediately. Um, okay, it is what it is. And it's not too bad. Mm hmm. Uh, for the side, that's my volume, like a pretty good box here for tempo. I didn't notice what mint was. We have a castle side, and that's my opponent's volume. Alright. I see how it is. Mm, I'm gonna be only up for knowledge uh, in this early game, huh? Interesting, but um, yeah, hopefully not gonna be too bad. I could have got a shock to you. No, no, not yet. Anyway, I really want the one. I think what is gonna be like really important, and going all the way over there for like another power would be probably bad, in my opinion. Mm hmm. Ah, uh, the four down, the five down is gonna be like the um the situation. <laughs> yeah, I wanted the site down. Yeah, I'll just take it. Oh, dungeon. Uh, I could be summoning something. Neck of softness. A oh, scouting! Wonderful. Uh, I also have a top art here. Ooh. I really, really want that, but uh, taking this top art might delay my break. I mean, my main town time by one turn, which actually is fine, especially if I set up the Vortex as well right now. And I can TP the... Oh yeah, yeah, I know exactly what I do. Yeah, yeah, I know exactly what I do. I have 16 mana next turn that I use to be back, and then I just pick up the mana Vortex and go out again. That way, it, it doesn't even matter if I don't reach my main town. I'm still gonna be fine, fully. Uh, the Necro Sodness ends up being pretty good in that case as well, if I play it in, uh, if I play it in this kind of way. Exactly. Mm-hmm. How much did Blue pay to get the hard ledge? A little bit over 6k. Which is uh, still like a pretty good trade for him, by the way. But I'm pretty confident that I'm gonna be winning too. So I'm not too worried. Oh, uh, there we go. Um, lots of mana available by now. Mm 
Sure, then I can pick up some of the premise stats as well. Yeah, I feel like I sometimes don't pay enough uh, attention to the premise stats in the early game. And that's not exactly like a reason for that to be the case, so I'm just gonna be changing that real quick. Um, yep, yep. <laughs> um, if I go here, would it be having like uh, 500 moves? Ah, uh, pretty good. Pretty good. Ah, uh, yep, yep. Then we go Mage Guild, we recover the mana, and uh, die with the spellbook. That was all, like, pretty good, actually. I do like it. I do like it. I also have, like, some pretty good bosses here, too. Not bad. Hmm. Actually, it's bad. It's bad. It's really, really bad. Um, here's the bad part. I'm Wizzly. This game, I'm pretty much Wizzly. I don't think there's a way to avoid the Wizzly by this point. So we just have to embrace the Wizzly. And live like Wizzly. It is what it is. Sometimes you're wise, and sometimes you're Wizzly. <laughs> Those two are not compatible, by the way. Oh, the um, Speedneck is actually doing wonders for me here. And yeah, it's Wizzly or Diply. Um, You know what? I would rather go Diply. Yeah, okay. So we managed to avoid the Wizzly at the very least, but it's still kind of bad. This is an amazingly big box. Which is nice. Mm-hmm. Um, sure. Uh, Meta the Sea are doing, like, a pretty good job here. Hey, so it's already on week one. That's amazing. Um, really good stuff. But now I don't have any ore, which is actually kind of a problem for me. I am really strong, though. Look at these stats on week one. Wow. Oh, I need this. Yeah, I, and I can actually get this too. This makes me be able to like at least single build the bird. That's what I was gonna say. Wait, what? Oh yeah, okay. I can still single build the birds. Yeah, sure. Um, let's do that. Let's do that at the very least, Dan. Mm -hmm. I want a little bit more ore, and then I want to go for like some of these objectives over here. Like the gold and the... Uh... Yeah, I mean, these objectives are pretty cool. I will only be able to get like one of these though. I actually thought I would somehow be able to squeeze in tea, like maybe the church out any treasury, but um, it wasn't even close. So I guess I would just like straight up wrong, which is something that I'm used to, so it's okay. Helm of Chaos, wow. I just need to go ahead and pick up the Schools of Magic from the Magic Union. As long as I can do that, I actually just win, by the way. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm basically picking up the Schools of Magic and Breaking, and that's like basically it. That's all I need to do to win this game. And that's probably all, all that I'm doing to win this game as well. It's all very, very simple. Oh, uh, wait, what was the middle faction again? It was... wait, we have no idea. Wait, don't we? No, we don't. Wait, what? No, it's dungeon. It's dungeon. Okay. <laughs> I need to not level up right now, but I also need to get some ore. Ah, uh, but I'm good. 
This is gonna be some XP. I can get like a little bit more XP actually. Yeah, these are these two are fine. These two are fine. Um, as far as the XP gain goes, of course. Hmm. But now I need to buy out the school of magic. Um, yeah, I mean both of the schools of magic. I think there's like another marketplace that I can buy, or no? No, no, no. Um, this is as good as I'm gonna get my race to be. Did I get my orb? Eh? I didn't. So I need to like try to pull the orb that I need. That is painful, but um, it has to be done. It most definitely has to be done. Let's have all these books, the finest copium in the south of Farfang. Mm-hmm. Papa. Um, Earth and Air both available. I mean, it's kind of sad that I have to buy it instead of rolling for it. Good players usually roll for it. I guess I'm not included in that list right now. It is what it is. Then, uh, anyway, I want to do this immediately. Mm, very small. Kind of sad. Hmm. I have, like, a pretty easy break here. But even this easy break is gonna be, like, a little bit hard for me to do in this, uh, kind of weak stage. All I ended up doing... Yeah, I didn't even get, like, that much XP on this turn. Um, uh, wasn't that great. Anyway. Uh, we can come back and, um... Hmm. I'm actually just doing these two bosses, I think, immediately. I'm really, really hoping that my next level up is gonna be, like, Air Magician, actually. In that case, I'm gonna be in a very good spot. Uh, but yeah, we'll see. We wide? Wait, are we wide? Um, okay. Um, sure. Let's continue, but it's our stream now. Um, yeah, but you're not wide. Can you call the stream yours if you're not wide? Mm-hmm. Mm. Okay, I want to go down here, and I do want to go for the vibrant box, actually. Uh, may as well pick up a little bit of permit power here, and um, yeah, let's go. Uh, slightly missed the deed, I guess. My tempo is actually not as good as I would like it to be. And this is gonna be like another small bulk, because it's um, not that many wyverns, all things considered. Mm. Yeah, I'm not sure I like this position that much. Anymore, at the very least. Okay, I get some crewmates, which I guess is gonna be bone. This is not where I meant it to be. Uh, at least I gotta rally, like, uh, quite a bit more army and be, like, pretty strong with this. Um, sure. My... I'm gonna be pretty close to leveling up, I'm gonna be walking out here, and then I can actually do the library immediately. Uh, yeah, I can, I can. I will be leveling up from the fight. I can actually, like, diagonally go into the desert immediately as well. That is an option that I do have. Hmm. But I also think that I'm, uh, I mean, I'm playing up against a Lord Heart. I'm expected to be, like, having, like, insane tempo to be able to kill him before he does, like, too much. But that is not what's happening at all. Yeah, that is, that is not what's happening at all. So, I'm actually kind of worried for this game. Yeah, I'm kind of worried. Hmm. Oh, uh, yeah, Diplo, anyway. Could have gone for a library earlier. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> uh, yeah, I did not acknowledge that. Doesn't really matter. I don't think my decisions would have been that much different, but... Um, yeah. Yeah, I didn't actually recognize that, at least immediately. And also, I clicked E. I clicked E. I'm sure I clicked E. I'm like 100% sure I clicked E. And my timer is in the gutter now because of that. Um, yikes. Mm-hmm. Um, either level up is gonna be fine here. Either Earth or Air, by the way. I'm not sure if, uh, which one I want more, even. Yeah, not sure at all. I ended up getting their magic, which means that I can actually build for this one pretty easily. But there's likely gonna be, like, more crewmates, which is... not bad. Wait, am I to be back to the Sleepy Creek again, though? That would be kind of horrible. Yeah, that'd be just horrible. I don't want that. At least right now.
Aha. And now we go over to Tartaglia, right? Um, yeah, because I really want to upgrade the crewmates, I can also upgrade these guys on my hero, of course, and that's all gonna be fine. So, wait, am I broken next turn or not? I can pick up the pit beans along the way and then just break the crystal dragons immediately. I can also just break the unicorns over here, too. Um, that is most definitely an option that I do have. Uh, maybe I can upgrade? No, I can not afford it quite. At least immediately, but I can do now. Okay. So this is my pretty pathetic army. Yeah, honestly, this army is like... There's a way to describe it. And the most accurate way to describe it, is, it actually is pathetic. Yes. But it's good enough. I need to just transition into middle army instead of like my bottom army. As long as I can do that, then I might just be able to win. Um, and that's... Oof, 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 oof. All right. You can play that game, it seems, so. Alright, why is every single RNG effect happening in this fight? Every single RNG effect! Oh, air dome. Um, Karas. Okay, I might be able to get, like, the captain set up early enough for it to kill my opponent immediately. I'm actually not that awful, but we'll see. Anyway, I need to go mid A some and just control mid and win like that. Um, that's also a pretty su successful break, at the very least. My road to mid is good, and actually, like, every single connection in this- Wait, this is like the most well-connected map that I've ever seen in my life, actually. Which is good for the aggressive player, I think. And the aggressive player is me, so it's good for me, actually. Hmm. That's nice. Yeah, that's very nice. I like that. Are you vortexed? I mean, I already vortexed on this week, so... I cannot vortex again to get my mana back. Mm, armor, I guess. Mine looks pretty good, Badger Garage is fine. I want to brush off the morale and the vibrance and then do the line shield after, I think. As I said, I want to brush off the bad morale. That is the main point of doing this fine. And also maybe like some XP, too. A nice little side bonus. And I will be able to reach my mid down um, next turn easily as well, which is kind of important to me, I guess. Um, yeah. Hmm. Fly in a single the team? I'll just try to double the team. I can reach mid very easily and very nicely. I say very nicely, but I have zero army. <laughs> as nice as the zero army reaches go, I guess. Hmm. Uh, another best of team immediately available here. It's gonna be like pretty good. I'm not a best of slot RT, but once again, these are like not the best best of slot RTs. And also, I think I made a mistake or two. Wow, that's really bad. That's really, really bad. My next time could be like completely useless because of this. Uh huh. I don't think I can afford to lose a turn here with this tempo. I mean, um, while having like no tempo against uh, Necro. I feel like I'm hard losing by now, actually. 
I do at the very least know that the Nightbomb didn't take like all the Hulls of Darkness. Anyway, there's nothing that I can do about this, right? Hey, it's your ball run. Mm, this would leave me with like 3k, 3k would leave me with nothing to do. Well, I mean, it is what it is. I think I could have reached by this moon, by the way. I did it just because I thought it didn't really matter. Um, that's a shame. I do not have the air that is rather unfortunate. I will be able to trade up the mage guild, right? Yeah, 100% I can. I know, okay. Okay, I know that I can. Um, it's gonna be fine. I think shield is gonna be like the best cast here. I'm gonna be like lightly brawling. Uh. Um, uh, this kind of sucks for me. Hmm. This wasn't exactly worth it, at least in this kind of way. Still no view error, really? Ugh, it is what it is. Uh, I can make fast and then I can like start going for all the bosses over here too. Um, at least save some timer, I guess. <laughs> Minimap looks like somebody doing squats. Wait, I see it. <laughs> oh my god, it actually does, doesn't it? Uh-huh. I'm gonna go Vortex immediately. The boss is easy. Copium. Ah, it's easy enough. I mean, it's not hard enough to sway me from trying to do the suicidal fine. That's all there is to it, actually, yeah. Ooh. Oh, Fire Magician or Archery. I guess it's gonna be Fire Magician. Then again, it's not even good against what my opponent is playing right now. Did I move all the way here? That I did it once. I think I did it once, yeah. Mm -hmm. Anyway, Red Dragons are gonna be like pretty cute. I also have the Cornucopium here already. Um, that's kind of something, and I can also stay out. I don't have to come back immediately. So I can like keep staying out and grabbing boxes. Yeah, I can be just grabbing boxes all day. Surprisingly a good choice. Oh, okay, Logo, finally. Um, Medusa is pretty good. Uh, spell power, gonna be amazing. And then I can do like another decently sized boss over here. And I could be back if I want to. I'm just not really sure if I want to, that's all. Oh my god! Wait, I have 10 dragons! Wait, I just... I just got 10 dragons! Holy, um, yeah, what now, losers? <laughs> Wait, oh, uh, my army just, I, I just got an army. I, I just got an army. I can go for the Gulpium, Tome of Fear Magic, and then go for like a Black Dragon timing. No, Black Dragon timing is going to be like really bad against an, um, Dread Knight Gamer. Hmm. Ooh, that's bad. I think I'm I think I'm on a very tight timer by this point. Um I'll try and see. Anyway, I'm gonna be like staying forward here. I'm gonna be fain I'm I'm gonna be faking it till I make it. He cannot like damage spell me and you know, or anything like that. But if he has animation as one of the potential cards that he can do, then suddenly black dragons are kinda of countered. Yeah, anime spam is really, really good against dragons, I think. At least black dragons. So that's why I don't want to go for that. I feel like it's kind of countered. Hmm. Did I see him? No. On oh, this and this? Yeah, okay. Oh, that's a lot of interference. That's kind of cool. Ooh, he's doing utopias. Ooh. Huh. 
I'm gonna go back a little bit. Oh, I need the Earthalm, I need the Kokorasia. And I need to get all of this on this week as well. That's a very important part for me. Ah, <laughs> uh, we can get the Logum. And I'm gonna be pushing for this little thing too. And also I'd like the Plumsy as well, which is kind of interesting. Don't have any resources to work with though. Uh, I guess we'll have to see. Oh, okay! Um, do I see him? Ooh, he just got the extra town. Okay. Steam version heroes are so bad, Lamal. What were they thinking? Money! That's what they were thinking. Anyway, um... We can just do this, that's fine. Oof. Oh, Monitors. Oh, quite a few of these guys by now, that's kind of cool. Mm, okay, no Sultans, thank god. Um, Sultans would have been actually really hard, so I'm very happy to not face any right now. Hmm... No breaths. Shame. Actually, I, took, I hit the wrong guy, and I'm gonna be losing way more because of that. Okay, no. Didn't end up being the case. I was wrong, and I'm really happy to be wrong here in this kind of case. I probably want to wait this guy up, so I can actually breath him for full damage. Otherwise, I can't even do that much. Um, extra luck of finally. And then I have like another DD to use. I guess I may as well pick, pick up the Cornucopium for full economy. I'm not even sure what I'm using the full economy for, but. I want to have the full economy, and now I'm gonna have the full economy. So Goose and Cornucopium will be both available to me, and I can generate a million resources. Yes, a million. Hmm. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I'm already kind of waiting for my Vortex, so... Do you want to stay out here? What do I want to do? I want to get my... How many times do I have to farm? Next time I have to, like, farm the last of the things and then set up the attack already. At least the beginning of the attack, you know? Um, I can equip the Goose, the Cornucopian, that's gonna be my two set up, then... I need the one set up again. Oops. I'm gonna go here to pick up the Celestial Neck, and there's gonna be like a uh, SOJ there and that side too. Sorry for spoilers, sorry for cheating, it is what it is. Nothing personal. I'm gonna get the Pillar of Ice as well. Dude, these stats are better than mine. Well, they're not really. Well, they kind of are, but not really. I'd like to double summon, at least try. Hmm. Bruh. Hmm, they're joining. Interesting. No, but like, I mean, this could be dragons. I can also get the few angels, you know? If I'm gonna be, like, looking for the attack, then me as well. And I can pick up the um, other item along the lane. That was looking for. Mono Kings, alright. I mean, it's not bad at the very least. Um, still no 1 to 2 ratio. And this is gonna be 10 ore, that's kind of insane. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna be setting up for the attack. Yeah, I'm gonna be setting up for the attack. So I have the other Vortex still available to me. Which I'm gonna be using to gain infinite mana. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's pretty much infinite mana. Wait, what? Oh yeah, right. Um, I can access it again. Now I have the infinite mana. And uh, yeah, I can go back to my two setup for now and we'll be good to go. Wait, I'm not on time! Wait, I completely miscalculated my timing. Ah, uh, that's not good. 
Now, Punk could also go for, like, the side zone TM. I'm not really sure if he wants to, though. Oh, I can see him. Oh, he's vampire gaming! What? But there's no way. That's correct. Anyway, my plan didn't change uh, upon seeing this. Um, if anything, I got him in Moore's part to make my plans happen. So, yeah, let's go. Has anyone achieved 1k LP? Um, yeah. Of course. It's not even that rare. Ah, uh, wait. Here. Here, here. Oh! I need to go for this one. Well, I mean, it's actually not that big of a deal, but... Ooh, my nails. Um, okay. Then let's test our luck. Actually, no, not yet. Um, I just want to go for Marketplace for now. Is that 21 ratio finally? It is, finally. Bird. Stop moving. <laughs> He's still running. What the hell? Um. <laughs> he was running. <laughs> okay, Artas. Interesting. <laughs> Okay, so now I get to, um... Hmm. Oh yeah, by the way, I get to summon again, don't I? Yeah, let's do summons. Birds. And birds. Oh my god, I only summon birds. I'm the bird whisperer. Mmm, dreadies. Lich is too. Not even, not even bad, actually. Uh, I kinda like it. But wait, he had six to buy. Is this after he bought the other ones? I also see his uh, library. I also have like, my casting pretty well set up. He does have a 34 power though. Uh, let's go to Ben. How about I go for Interference, actually? Yeah, let's go for Interference. Mm, it'll do. Air Orb on Pegasime. I see it, Ben. I don't like what I see. Boom, boom. Oh, he's actually defending. Interesting. Kind of an army. Mm, no power here, it's kind of weird. I'm um, not that much man on him either. Yeah, I want to be interfering him, I think. Um, yeah, so down to 22 power for him. That's pretty good. And I get to chain him! Is that what I want to do? Yeah, that's kind of what I want to do. Is he going to be animating, I wonder? I'm going to just, like, trade cast. Mm-hmm. I have Mods on Moralco. I also have some Dreddies on my own, too. <laughs> I have like lots of mana toys, mana superiority, um, stat superiority, and probably armor superiority too. Uh, my biggest regret right now is not having the air orb. That's very unfortunate for me. Maybe protecting from air is gonna be like my uh, my cast of choice here, actually. Uh, we'll see. His dreads are better than yours, sorry. You should you don't have to be sorry. I can accept facts. You see, his dreads are dealing 25 to 40 damage, my ones are dealing 15 to 30. I have uh, pleb knights. He has Giga Chad Knights. 
It's, um, yeah, it is what it is. Always have protection, uh, naturally. You could probably, like, get almost every single one of these red dragons down. That's kind of ridiculous, actually. Well, that's in case he has, like, air tome and air orb. Okay, goes with the slow. I still have speed prio, which is pretty cool for me. Not, yeah, yeah, I do have the speed prio. That's nice. <laughs> I mean, my mic is quite a bit better, though. I stream for long. I'm not ending in my regular timer because I ended up starting so late. I will not miss morale. Only bad players miss morale. And I'm not a bad player. That ain't me. Okay, it bounced to the correct side. That's pretty lucky of me. Um, is he gonna be enemy spamming? Let's see. He is, okay. He can take the retail and hit me quite a bit. Then again, there's not that much armor here inside anyway. And I... Yeah, it doesn't have like a lot of attack skill. I mean, if he double hits with the dreadies, then it could be like some damage, I guess. I just need to kill all the dreadies and sit on their corpse, I guess. If I can do that, then I win. Speed 7, speed 11. Um, he is actually pretty fast. Uh, what was your first cast? Chain Lightning. Then I followed up with a Chain Lightning. Which led pretty nicely into Chain Lightning. Um, yeah. Not bad. Hmm. He's starting to go for my chain line to be worse. Uh, how much does the anime actually? Hmm, chain lightning, ten dread knights. It's actually one chain for one. Yeah, it's actually about even. Yeah, it's a wash. He has to cast something like proactive right now. Ah, that's not very proactive actually. Mm, yeah, I don't think that's gonna be good enough for him. Uh, but we'll see, we'll see. It's gonna be like really, really hard for him to deal with like stacks like Minos here. It might actually come down to mana here. Mm -hmm. How can you even win against anime spam? Um, well, like this, I guess. You shall see. Hmm, hits here. Alright. Ooh, what? I mean, I guess he did wants to control the chain lightning bounces, but I mean, that actually suits my purposes, if anything. I mean, third bounce here, that's okay. The worst case on R for Glues is Dread Knights getting body blocked, I guess. And that is the absolute worst case scenario for him. And I guess that's the uh, thing that I want to catch my myself. That's what I want to have happen, naturally. Uh, does my chain kill my own? Actually, yeah, he would be getting the speed prior if I were to chain here. Uh, that's pretty unfortunate for me. 
It means that it's like not a very good cast at all. Uh is it not? It could still be fine. What if I force him to chain instead of um instead of enemy for like one room? Uh, this might be forcing it. Uh, we'll see. Anyway, it's up to him to be proactive. I think that he's chaining gear, attacking gear, and it's like gonna be pretty devastating to me, but I think I might just stabilize. Wait, can he even like walk out right now? Out of the mill? How did TX units work in the mode again? Wait, I don't even remember if he can walk out right now. He won't chain, surely dreads obliterate elementals. Do they though? I mean, I already have offense and pretty free attack versus his 24 defense. And uh yeah. Yes he can. If you put Mono Kings uh, too forward, he would be stuck. Well yeah, of course. I recognize that much. Oh too yeah. No, here would not be stuck. He could walk out anyway. It would have to be free forward. <laughs> Ooh, that's damage, huh? Um, shield's up here, too. For now, he's playing for some mana efficiency by this point. I think I'm... And I'm gonna be shielding myself as well, actually. <clears throat> okay. You lost that stronghold game. What a big Um, that stronghold game. Oh yeah, I did. I did. It was actually kind of quite the pro, actually. Yeah, I agree. I deserve to get flamed for that one. There's not a lot that he can do. He actually chose to wait. Huh. Speed 7, but these are moving last. I can actually just move this right now. <laughs> well, he knows my... what I want to do by this point. Uh, but that's okay. I don't think there's like much for him to interact with here. I mean, he can enemy spam, but that's not good enough. I think it's not good enough. I mean, it could be. I can double damage, I can moral here. I can proc some things. Enemy by now, right? He can just do that. Anime into hit. Ah, uh, what does he hit this? This would be pretty painful for him, actually. Um, it goes for that line. Um, that's fine. Um, that's kind of annoying by this point, though. Anime immediately, I wonder. No. Um, chooses to do nothing for now. I could be summoning more, but this is, like, very effective as well. So... Oh! The moral! Oh, the moral's big. Yeah, the moral's like really, really big. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's like so much pressure, actually. It's like a difference of five Dread Knights. It's kind of amazing. That's an enemy immediately this time. Yeah. But if I'm getting the better of him here. Um, let's go. Yeah, I'm pretty sure line of balls are gonna be good enough here for me. Oh, by the way, did he just defend? Oh, he did just defend. That's interesting. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm overwhelming him. I am overwhelming him. 
He's dealing some damage over time, but he's also like running out of mana completely. This guy is just the retail taker, so the other stacks can do enough damage. Oh my god! They're dead! And I can... yeah. Okay. Later! Oh my god! Woo! The good morale of monitors! Actually, the, wait, somebody called monitors carrying, by the way. Wow. And yeah, they did carry really, really heavily here. That's awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> All I can say is XD. You... You don't have to say anything, Lee. Just accept this sweet embrace of death. <clears throat> Did you get my book also? XD, I know. Yeah. <laughs> oh my. Uh, GG, thanks for playing. <laughs> what do you call the opposite of a pro? Because this is a... It's comeback. Uh, the opposite of a pro is a comeback. Right? Isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. You did get the uh, seven. Yeah, all of them. Interesting. Wow! Uh, amazing. That was really good. Um, next. <laughs> uh, you want to play some more Necro? <laughs> I don't think Blue paid enough for Necro. Should try again. Um, yeah, definitely should. One mole! Yeah, one mole. Ah, uh, we can end the prediction. Choose outcome. The winner was Lexia. Yes, indeed. It is always Lexia.